Hey guys, this is Delta 6. Just wanted to make a video on our vest and what we use and what we trust and put our faith in to get us home at the end of the night right after this. So the vest that we ordered and that we trust with our lives is the Safe Life Defense Level 3A+. And on the vest, um, as you can tell, I've pretty much set everything up the way I like it at least. Um, apologize if the camera's shaking. I'm actually doing this in the patrol vehicle on shift. Um, but I've gotten all this stuff from Signal 15, which is one of our local law enforcement security stores. And I think it was pretty much almost all of it for less than a hundred as far as um, everything that you see on there apart from the body cam, the mic, um, the badge obviously. Um, all of that alone for just the holsters at least was literally less than a hundred. And I also have another holster for um, nitro gloves that I usually have on my duty belt. Um, but as far as the vest goes, right here we have three mags um so it's a velcro mag holder and i like it because it works nice it's easy to you know slide in and out as far as um any normal size magazines and what i like about it is if you have extended mags or anything like that which you shouldn't but if you do use anything larger capacity than 15 17 rounds um, this strap actually can accommodate for larger magazines, um, which is what I like it for. Plus, it's more maneuverable. It's not something that is um, hard or stiff that, you know, is not flexible and moves with you. So I picked out that one. Uh, my partner actually has the harder case, which he likes better. Um, obviously, this is the body cam that I use, which I got on Amazon. I believe it was about $150, $160, but this body cam, guys, is amazing. It comes with an extra battery, um, a charging base for the unit and the battery, so you can charge them both at the same exact time. This also has night vision. It has, you know, LED lights, which is right here, over here, and over here, so you can use it, and it's actually a pretty strong light. Um, just in case if you run out of batteries, for instance, on your flashlight that you should have on your, your belt or your vest. Um, but if y'all guys don't have any body cams, I would suggest getting it. It really gives you good content. The video quality is amazing on it. So once we get some good, uh, you know, incidents, you know, hopefully we don't get any pretty crazy ones. But, um, you know, anything for trespassing or domestic issues. If we do catch it on body cam, if it's something that we can upload, we'll definitely do it. And it does come with an SD card, which I like, because you can just pop it out, put it in your laptop, and go from there. You know, just upload it and do what you got to do. Um, the badge here, if y'all guys are interested um, in where we got that, we actually got it off a website from Badge and Wallet. And they make some really high-quality badges. Um, the great thing about them is you know they're sturdy they last long they look professional they're hard to break um we actually ordered this as well which is the belt clip and usually this is on my um actual duty belt i don't usually put it on my vest but i wanted to show this guy to you guys because uh badge and wallet really did a good job on our badges for sure um this here is actually um, a push knife so I have this for you know last emergency and I tuck it behind there because um, you know most people um, can't carry them if you will but for me that's good for cutting seat belts um, as well as like I said it, it's your last defense if you're on your back and you, you know they're trying to take your gun and they got the drop on you you can always pull that out of your vest very easily um, and use it to subdue anybody that you know is attacking you for sure 
Um, over here to the left of the body cam, this is a cell phone pouch, which I like because our, our comms or communications rather, um, is based off of a phone app. So the phone app is Zello and it works amazing as far as keeping our communications. It's free to use. It logs all of your, you know, reports that you put over the radio you can send pictures, text on it. Um, so it's a really good thing, guys, if you're looking for any kind of communication software or app or anything that's, you know, you don't want to pay money for. Um, and it goes just right off of everyone's cell phone. So if you if you don't have phones for your guys or your sites and your patrol vehicles, um, they can you can give them access on their personal phone. All they would have to do is download it, and you would just invite them to your channel. And like I said, guys, you can use it anywhere, um, anytime. And it really is amazing when it comes to, um, as far as the communications for keeping a record, especially if you have things going over the radio that gets pulled up for court, you have all the messages there that you can just give over to a district attorney, law enforcement, or whoever is requesting it. And to the left of the cell phone pouch, this here is um, my flashlight holster, which I got this on Amazon, I would say years ago, but this thing is amazing. Um, it has different focuses on it, so you can make it to where it is um, flashing slowly. You have a steady burn, and then you have a rapid and you can adjust it by pulling it in and out telescopically to where you can adjust the actual beam. So if you wanted it, you know, very pinpointed um, at something or you wanted it widespread, you can also do that. Um, and like I said, guys, all this stuff is very cheap. You can also get stuff on Amazon. Um, all of that um, is cheap and it's pretty good quality. You know, that's what I started with was Amazon stuff. Uh, right above that, we have our handcuff key and lock and a pen. And then this is actually um, up here is our mic that we use. And it works with the Zello app. So it's a push to talk mic. And it works amazing. Um, if you want, you could always plug it into an earpiece like I do so that your communications are not loud over the radio uh, to where everybody can hear it and other than that guys that's pretty much it um, so as far as the vest goes like I said safe life defense is based out of California they're a little bit pricey but honestly guys I don't know if you've seen the there's a lot of commercials on YouTube and other places um, these vests are comfortable they're lightweight they I mean they're just amazing vests altogether as far as the quality and the level 3a plus i mean can stop a lot of high powered rounds which is what we um you know mostly would come across in our jobs you know on a apartment site or you know any random place in the u.s um what i also like about it is you can also add hard plates on top of your soft plates um so there is an option for that as well. And as you can tell, the DSS protection officer, um, that actually comes printed on a Velcro strip. When you order it, you can customize it to whatever you want it to say. And the back, which is what I like, is also printed um, the DSS protection officer, but it also has my call sign above and my blood type which is AB neg and that is important um, you know god forbid you ever do get shot and it's not in your vest and like you know if you got shot in your arm your leg or whatever the case is and you're losing blood at least the paramedics will know your blood type and I think that's important for for everyone and all security should wear a vest um, even if you're unarmed, I mean, at this day and age, the way it is, um, we just had a person, a female officer for another company, 
in South St. Pete go missing and they found her body burned underneath one of the bridges uh, by the Skyway Bridge, I believe, somewhere around there. Um, and she was just on her job like any other day and someone abducted her and killed her for God knows what reason. Um, I don't think they ever figured it out who did it, but, you know, hopefully they do. Um, but I don't know if she was armed or unarmed. I'm pretty sure she was unarmed, though, because uh, if she was getting abducted, I'm sure she would have um, used deadly force at that point out of fear. Um, but for the unarmed people, you know, wearing a vest is smart because you never know what situation you're going to go into. Um, you know, something as simple as a loud music complaint could turn into someone with a knife out of their kitchen, you know, coming out of the front door pissed off. Um, you know, the loud music isn't always for fun. It's also to, um, you know, in other words, hide the fact that someone's arguing or going through some issues and they use the music so that the neighbors don't hear what's going on. Um, which we had that issue on one of our sites before and, you know, before we actually got here and two residents got in an altercation about loud music and they, you know, they, one guy came over and started stabbing the other guy. Um, so, you know, being unarmed, like I said, you know, it's important to wear these cause they do protect against knives. They do protect against, you know, most rounds and ammunitions and rifles. So definitely guys, if, if you guys don't have a vest, I would honestly suggest getting it. And this here, um, is also a pull strap. So if you're injured and you have a partner with you, they can grab onto this and drag you out of the way to safety. Um, but yeah, guys, I just wanted to make this video and show you guys what we use and what we trust. And as I said before, sorry for all the shaking. I'm actually just holding the phone up, doing this in the patrol car real quick. Um, but if you guys have any questions on this, you know, definitely uh, leave some comments below and I'll get back to you with any information. And if you're interested in getting one of these vests, like I said, it's Safe Life Defense. They're based out of California. And I believe the price for this one was around $750 to $850. Uh, they do have the ones that go underneath. Um, so if you have more like a Class A uniform, um, you know, what for whatever company you're working for, it can go underneath those as well. Same as what law enforcement wears. And actually a lot of law enforcement has switched over to Safe Life Defense because of how lightweight their, you know, ballistic vests are. And they have a lot of other cool stuff. So definitely, guys, if you don't have a vest, please, for your safety and for getting home at the end of the day, you guys should definitely, you know, invest in this. Because, I mean, who knows? It might just save your life one day. And, you know, it's not like I'm sponsored by safe life defense i'm just making this video because i want you guys to know what we trust what we you know put our faith in to get us home at the end of the night if it's on a bad night but other than that guys that's the end for this video and once again if this is your first time please hit that subscribe and like button and share and you know leave comments if you have any questions we'd love to hear from you and y'all guys be safe and have a good night